time straight game two days, I'm sure they will be full, full fun on it. But I booked uh, Lion King on 19th. <laughs> the first day it came out. Good job. <laughs> right. Uh, I think we all got the first answer yesterday. What's the maximum amplitude? Eight. Eight. Mm. What's the minimum? Two. What? Two. 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 Now, Ben, I know. Did you? Did you were you going to say what? Minus. <laughs> were you going to say what? Minus. Three. Now that's I. Listen carefully to the English, okay? Listen carefully. I think Gao understood this. If I said to you, "What's the maximum?" That's eight. If I said, "What's the minimum?" You could say that's maybe minus eight. But the word amplitude always, always means positive height. You know? Oh. Um, so it's positive. Actually, do you know what? I have the program here. I can draw it. I want to show you something. The first one is 5 sine x. No, hang on. And then the other one here is, what's the other one? 3 sine x. These are the two waves. Now here's, here you have your two waves. The amplitude is this height here. The first wave is 5 and the second wave is 3. A uh, 2, isn't it? A 3, sorry. Now let's add them together. You get 8 sine x. Let's see what that looks like. See here it is here. This has an amplitude of 8. We say its maximum is 8, its minimum is minus 8, but its amplitude is 8. Okay. But what you could do is you could combine these like this. Watch. 5 sine x. Let me clear that. 5 sine x. Oh, I hope I get this right plus 3 sine x minus pi over 2. So this has amplitude 5, this still has amplitude 3. All I've done is I've moved them a little bit apart. Now if I draw this, whoops, no, it's gone. 5 sine x plus 3 sine x minus pi over 2. Right, now let's draw this. Uh, what's this one? Amplitude. Okay, I think I could make it smaller. Let me try again. Uh, not pi over 2. Maybe I'll just start to try pi. Yeah, there we go. There you go, Ben. So you see, I can combine them to make it have an amplitude of only 3. I can't make it any smaller than 3. You know? Sorry, two. I can't make it any smaller oh, so, than two. So it's all, oh, I know, I know. You know what I mean? Empty, empty two is the... The height. Uh, yeah. Okay, good. And what is this process called? Interference. Interf yeah, interference or the other name for it, the more fuller name, is called super... Position of waves. The um, this is the this is the name for the rule that a total equals a one plus a two. It could be minus a two. You know. But you could have the waves cancel as well. Okay. Uh, what is this one here? This is our double slit. Uh, they're arranged 15 centimeters. So this is 15, is it? Mm. Okay, so D is 15. Mm. And D is 80. I think we can use the centimeter. We could use centimeters, yeah. 
What does the word coherent mean? Have a constant phase, phase difference. Yes. And same lamp. Yeah. Yep. <coughs> That's it. Uh, sketch the pattern. Okay, so you know what this looks like. You'll get one bright spot here, then less bright, less bright, less bright. Something like this. Right, this one's a little bit harder. Explain why you get this. Did you write anything for that? Press plus press uh, maximum uh, press plus rows. Trough. 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 Good. Nearly perfect. The only problem is they also want you to talk about path difference as well. Oh. So what you should say, uh, Ben, is uh, crest meets crest because the path difference equals zero and uh, 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 forms a larger crest. Yes, which you're right, Ben, is the maximum. Then you should say trough meets crest the pat difference is half a wavelength I think or yeah yeah forms uh, uh, a uh, minimum. So the only thing you were missing, Ben, was this. What was the path difference? Hmm? The path difference? So what happens here is the reason this is so bright is because the wave here and the wave here if you were to look at the two waves here, you would see that they're together. Is this wave not this wave? I'm just, no, I'm just drawing it roughly. Uh, but if you were to look, say, like here, okay, this wave, up, down, up, down, maybe up, okay? Whereas here, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. When the two of them meet, difference yeah they're, they're, y they're equals half by that. well well look here, here's the crest here oh maybe it's not half maybe it's quarter is it sorry here's the crest here they're different by oh sorry yeah it's it's not a half is it is a quarter of a wave why is quarter? I'm trying to get them to cancel I want the crest to meet the trough no, it's a half or quarter, Chambers. It's a uh, half. Quarter. A quarter. Hang on. No, that's a full one. I know what I'll do. I'll just draw it. Yeah. I'll draw sine x. Now look. If you want this, no, I think it is a half. I think it is a half because um, if I move the wave by pi, yeah, they cancel if you add them together. Watch. Sine x plus sine x minus pi. Let's draw this. See, you can't see, it's cancelled. So if I take one wave and move it half a wavelength, then when I add them, they cancel because the crest and the trough meet. So uh, yes, I was right the first time. It is, it is half a path difference.
Okay. Okay. What's the wavelength? If, if the x is 10. So we know that d is 0 0.15, d is 0 0.8, and x is 0 0.1. And x equals lambda d over d. So lambda is x d over d, which is 0 0.1, 0 0.15, 0 0.8. Yeah? 0 0.8. Thank you. No? No. Uh, okay, I use meter. Can you type this in, Gao? See what you get. I use meter. Ah? Yeah, I use also meter. Uh, yeah. 188, correct. Maybe you offend me if you say that. <laughs> no, it's my mistake. Sorry. You know, I go to church every week. Sorry. <laughs> right. It's okay. Um, what would happen if the wavelength was reduced by four, what would happen to the x? Going down. By how much? Four. four. Yeah. One mark. If the lambda becomes lambda over four, oh. then the x will become x over four. Huh? I think he asked for four factors. Describe the effect on the fringe width by reducing the wavelength by a factor of four. That means you make it four times smaller. Okay. Uh, I mean this four factor was the Yeah, I read like effect effect the four factor. Oh no. Did you not think that was strange because there's only one mark? Yeah. Like four things. Yeah. So I <laughs> no, okay. I just think this question is problem. Okay, the, I understand the problem. The, in English, the word factor has two meanings. Okay, so just to be clear. Ben, English time. In English, the word factor has two meanings. The first meaning means it's multiply. For example, you could say four is a factor of 40 because 40 equals 10 times 4 but the second meaning is it's a reason mm. so what factors make you tired or whatever I don't know so oh, this question is x uh, yeah so in this question here the meaning is multiply uh, so x so yeah reduce reduce divide by four if it shows like four that would be clear i think ah the number four yeah yeah i yeah so i i don't know the c question yeah let's do it now Light passes through a gradient of 1,000 lines per millimeter. What is the line spacing? So the spacing is one millimeter over 1,000. That's 10 to the minus six, which is one micrometer. Okay, because what you have is you have one millimeter and a thousand lines. So the distance between two of the lines is a, mi is a micrometer. Um. 
Yeah, we have a radio of it. You show us the radio. Oh, it's Do great. I? Yeah, this 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 space spacing of life. Okay, next. Uh, what's the wavelength? Using the formula n lambda equals d sine theta. 1 lambda equals 10 to the minus 6 sine 25. So what is the lambda, please, go? Or Ben? Four point two three and ten parallels minus seven. Okay. And lastly, what is the maximum? How many are visible? So this one here, you use the formula n lambda is less than d. So that means n is less than d over lambda which equals 10 to the minus 6 over 4.23 times 10 to the minus 7, which equals uh, 10 to the minus 1 over 4.23. No, 10 to the plus 1. No, no, I don't need the calculator. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. You don't need the calculator because this will be 2 point something, won't it? <laughs> will it be Will it be 3? Will it be three? No. 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 Will it be at least two? Yeah. So the n must be between minus two and plus two. Uh, two plus two plus three six. So you have look, you'll have n zero. Mm. You'll have n one. Look, go, go, look. You'll have n two. You can't have n3. It's not possible. It's not possible. The n must be less than 3. Mm. Minus 1, minus 2. So the answer is 5. What's wrong? And why the the last question we just put n is one? What lambda is called? Lambda is one. N is one. Oh, for the one before it. Ah, because in the question they said uh, the first bright maximum at twenty five. The n is one first. Is that center one? No, you see, yeah, their English is very. Their English is wrong. Because you're right, the first one is really in the centre. Um, but I understand that they, they didn't really mean this because they said the angle is 25. Okay. So I understand what you're saying, Gav, they should have really said the first non-centre fringe. Okay, I'll tell you what we'll do, because we still have time, right? <laughs> if you try to finish number five now, then at about 10.15, I'll do the answer, and then we have two exams finished, mm -hmm. which is good. How many six? Uh, is it six or five? I thought it was five. five. There's only five questions five, in five, physics, yeah. yeah. So if you finish that now, then in about 15 minutes, I'll do the answer. Maybe, no, no, not 15 minutes, in about 10 minutes, 10 minutes, I'll do the answer. How to calculate the row? Row? Density? Yeah. 